How did you find that your cancer diagnosis and journey through recovery changed your relationship with writing? Like at what point did you go, okay, I'm going to commit to writing fiction now. I'm going to do this more than just for fun. I'm going to look to find a publisher. Um, I was, I, I think I started to think that when I did the blog and when, when the blog um, got more readers and, and when I started getting feedback from people that they were looking forward to the next blog. Where's the blog? What's the blog about today? You know, or I really like your blog, it really made me laugh or whatever. Um, then I thought, I really don't want to go back to work. You know, I mean, I did go back to work. I had to go back to work. But I, 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 at that point, I thought, I don't want to do the sort of work I'm doing for the rest of my life. I want to do something with creative writing. Um, and then it, I think it cemented, it was towards the end of the year when Jane died and when I saw her in hospital. And I thought, I've got to do this, you know. I will regret it if I don't. So I think that was a kind of pivotal point in my in my journey. And then I think once you decided you're going to do something, there's a theory, isn't there, that if you... Your mind on something, the universe will um, conspire to make it happen. So things kind of fell into place, not straight away. I mean, I wouldn't have had the energy anyway after going back, uh, going back to work after having cancer. I needed a bit of time just to, um, you know, stabilize. And my immune system was really low. I didn't have much energy. So it was good to have a job that paid me to get back into that. But then after about a year or so, this opportunity came up to take the redundancy. So I went for it and it all kind of happened from there really. And I, I think as a writer, your, your, your journey is ongoing. You, you never know quite where it's gonna take you. And it also doesn't really matter how old you are. You can write at any, any age. You know, it's something you can carry on doing or you can even start. I mean, some people don't start writing till they retire, which is good. Yeah, I think it's never too late and it's never too early to get started. 